Hello and welcome to Spruce Grove Dodge. My name's Shawnee and today we're going to be taking you walk around this 2016 Ram 1500 Rebel Edition Crew Cab in bright white. Underneath the hood she has the legendary 5.7 liter V8 Hemi engine putting out 395 horsepower. It's got the nice new grill that the Rebel Edition has. Some tow hooks in the bottom there. Sport hood, factory headlights, signal light indicators down on the bottom, as well as some fog lights. Beautiful, tough looking truck. Coming around to your front tire here, there are Toyo Open Country all season tires mounted on top of a 17 inch factory rim. Molded mud flaps on all four corners. Black side steps. You have those black OEM fender flares that match the bottom of the truck. Black badging. Signal light indicators down the bottom. They are powerful defrosted. I'll show you that in a moment. Beautiful looking truck. Tons and tons of great options to see. So let me go grab the keys and I'll show you the inside. Alrighty, helping you into this beautiful Rebel is your factory key fob. It has your unlock, lock, command, start, panic button, and that button there is actually for your air ride suspension. So to start the vehicle with the key fob, just simply ensure the vehicle is locked, hit that half circle twice, and it'll start. Beautiful. Now this is a proximity key, so you simply just have to have it in your purse, in your pocket, walk it up to the vehicle, and it unlocks. If you want to lock it back up, just simply hit that button and it locks it back up. If you want to unlock it because we're going inside. Alrighty, so the Rebel has this beautiful red accent color everywhere. It's everywhere, I'll show you. Already in the door here, you have that compartment as well as some cup holders, all your power options, your unlock and lock, your power mirror, or windows, pardon me, that's to lock those back windows, your power mirror options. That button there is to actually power fold the mirrors in. So you just hit that button and it folds in. One more time, folds it back up. Easy to use if you're in a tight parking space or anything like that. All your lighting options there. Beautiful all weather floor mats. Power adjustable driver's seat, like I said, with that red accent. And then you have half leather and then you have half a little bit of like a cloth material but it has that very cool tire marking all the way down very very unique and then you have the rebel of course stitched into the seat very very nice so hop in using my handy dandy step stool and start it up all right so just put on the brake and press that button tire monitoring system abs traction control all that good stuff now this beautiful Rebel only has 15,297.3 kilometers. Tons and tons of life left in this truck. But make sure you talk to one of our finance managers about any extended warranties that you may want to purchase just to ensure that you are fully covered. So that screen there is actually controlled by these buttons here. So I'll just push that and go through that with you. So as you can see on the top there, you can find out what radio station you listen to, what direction we're facing, how um, hot or cold it is outside, your average fuel um, economy, and then you have the little clock down there as well. Alrighty, so push those buttons. Alrighty, so we're on vehicle info, uh, so oil life, gauge summary, engine hours, tire pressure monitoring system, your air suspension, and transmission temperature, and oil temperature. We've got our fuel economy there, trip A, trip B. If you had a trailer attached, it'd show everything there, your audio, stored messages, screen setup, and then we're back to the speedometer. So like I said, I was just pushing those buttons here. And then above that, you have your voice control and Bluetooth. Audio controls on the back of both sides, and then your cruise control options on this side. Gear shifter right there. So two-wheel drive, for lock, and for low. Nice big touch screen. You have AM, FM, satellite radio your climate options, navigation, see where you're going, 
this is the app. So this actually controls everything if you wanted to just leave it on this and everything's there rather than pushing the buttons down here. Totally up to you. You have heated seats on both sides and then a heated steering wheel. Backup camera, which I'll show you in a second. USB auxiliary Bluetooth SC for media options. And then of course you have your Bluetooth. If I just throw it into reverse, as you can see nice backup camera as well as you have rear parking sensors. Very, very handy to have, that's for sure. So down here you have your volume and tuner, screen off if you want that screen off above, hazard lights, back button, and then you have your climate control buttons here if you choose to use them. Your air ride suspension buttons here, heated seat and steering wheel, traction control, toll haul, and if you want to turn those rear parking sensors off. Nice little compartment there. As well as here you have a compartment which you can actually it fits your phone if you have an iPhone. Um, I only say that because that's what kind of phone I have and I know it fits there. Uh, cup holders here. And then you have a dual center console spot for your change. As well as the SD USB auxiliary port and another USB charging port there. And then a larger one. Come on over into the center here you have the rubble. And then you have top part here and then of course your glove compartment beautiful up here you have programmable garage door openers rear sliding window and a sunroof very very nice to have that's for sure beautiful well there's still tons more to see so stick with me and i'll show you the rest Alrighty, so I got that back door open for you. It is a crew cab, so it's one of Dodge's larger cabs. So as you can see, tons and tons of leg room back here. Little compartment in the door. Beautiful all-weather floor mats. Underneath the floor mat, you got that removable compartment here. Easy to clean. Back of the seats are red. Very, very nice. You got that tire marking in the seats back here as well. This folds down, gives you an extra armrest and some cup holders if you're not using that seat. There is a couple cup holders down there. 12 volt plug in, flip the seat up, and you have this, which is an awesome, awesome feature. If you fold both sides down, it's completely flat back here, so easy to haul something. Great, great. Then you have another little compartment down there. Beautiful. give you a close-up on those mud flaps your rear parking sensors right there dual exhaust nice big black ram and rebel 4x4 very very nice trailer braking system lockable tailgate camera then you do have this beautiful back flip tonneau cover very nice to have Keep everything brand spanking new back here. Very, very nice. Of course, there's all your safety anchors and child locks you would need. If you're hauling around any little ones, fold that seat up. Show you the other side. I had my truck, I wish my truck had these, but just didn't come with it. Very, very handy. Another one of those compartments on this side. And door compartments. Little compartment there. Power adjustable seat on this side too. Cup holders in the door, as well as another compartment. Well, if you're interested in taking this beautiful Ram Rebel for a test drive, just simply click or call. We're down here at 200 St. Matthews Ave in Spruce Grove, Alberta. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. Take care.